Hijo de Kirin. Hi, welcome back to my vlog. We are on holiday this week with Danny's family. So I thought I'd start a new vlog. We're already like halfway through the week. We arrived on Sunday and it's Wednesday today. And we're here until we don't really know yet. It's up to Juliet. We're right now staying in a house with Danny's family. But tomorrow we're going to stay in a hotel for three nights. In Gaelog. We're currently in oh, Barakro. Yeah. Yeah, we're up Barakro. We thought it was Badakro, but it's Barakro. This is the view from the house. It's so nice. Look at that view. Here's the living room. Lovely. Danny went on a walk today up in Monroe. I'm talking kind of quietly because I don't want Danny's family to hear me. If anyone is familiar with Monroe's. Here's my outfit today. Wearing this Zara dress. Nobody cares. But it's kind of cold, so I've put this jumper on. We're also going pizza. out tonight. Pizza. There's a pizza van. So I'll show you that too, because I'm really excited. I need to put some makeup on before we go out. You were going to do that anyway, but I don't think you did. It's also a pizza and Prosecco van. But there was no Prosecco van. There's no Prosecco, like Prosecco on the menu, so I don't know if... Do you, when you order pizza, do you get free Prosecco? Yeah. I don't know. What's the... I don't like Prosecco, but if it's free, I will take it. <laughs> I'll get it, didn't we? <laughs> yeah, no idea, but we'll find out. I've just finished my hair and makeup for tonight. I honestly feel really, really ugly. Don't know what it is, but I don't have time to change anything, so I'm just going to have to leave it. Don't know if it's because this jumper is so big, but I just feel like I look really bad, to be honest. It's five minutes, they walk around. We just got back for a nice morning walk with Toddy. There he is. It's really warm today. I can't look a mess. We're currently waiting for Danny's parents to get back with breakfast. And then I think we're going to have a beach day. We went to the beach the other day, but I think we're going to go to a new beach today. So I filmed a bit of that, but I did film the beach the other day, so I don't want it to be repetitive. So if you can hear the kettle as well. Cool then. Also, I don't know if you saw last night, but it turned out that the pizza place you had to book. So we weren't able to go, but I think we're going to go next week. Hmm. It's only open Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So I think we're going to go next Tuesday, but we ended up going to the pub next mm. door and had yeah. fish and chips which was nice. We had a really nice view. I look really, really bad, but I thought I'd give you a tour. There's not much to show you. Anyway, it's pretty basic and aged. Here is big change from the one we stayed in in Manchester. Yeah, I, don't, I don't think it's quite up to a board's level. Two beds, because Danny smells. Then here is the bath, and the bathroom's pretty rough. Wow. To be fair, there aren't exactly many places to stay here. It's a nice old building, though. Yeah, nice building, but just not the nicest on the inside. Mm. But we just went to a shop, so I'll give you a haul. We bought some of these for tomorrow, because Danny's going on a walk tomorrow. Again. And I'm going to be by myself in the hotel room for quite a while. So I had to buy some snacks. I actually bought two packets, just ate one. They were quite good. We bought some 
popcorn for tonight. I look so, so bad. I bought some ramen for tomorrow. Bought an apple ties for right now. What's this? wonder what that does. Also, please ignore this outfit. It looks really terrible. I was planning on changing, but I can't be bothered anymore. <sighs> You're a wee stunner. No, I'm not. I look really bad. You look nice though. <laughs> I just showered and got changed and I feel a bit better now. So I'm wearing this Ralph Lauren and we're wearing Ralph. polo top that I got in a charity shop. And nice. then I'm wearing these checkered trousers. It's not a great outfit to be honest, but I just wanted to wear something a bit better than the last one. Also, I'm pretty sure my face is burnt. On, I did not understand. I made myself a cup of tea, I lay in bed, watched on YouTube, and now I'm gonna do a face mask. I also did attempt to do a workout, but it just it wasn't happening. I got this face mask the other day from this like we shop near here it was called perfume studio it's just this mask but i tried it the other day and i actually really liked it i also bought a, a night cream from there but it kind of made my face burn a bit i am by myself for most of the day in this hotel room hopefully no one in the nearby rooms can hear me danny is away walking up a monroe it's terrible lighting i don't really know what time he's gonna be back to be honest it's gonna be quite warm today i think i was thinking about i kind of want to walk to the beach it's literally just across the road but i'm nervous i can't decide i'll see how i feel after i shower i also kind of wish i'd like bought like a notebook so i could like journal or something which i never do but this kind of feels like the kind of place i should journal if that makes sense we also put the beds together last night i actually didn't have a very good sleep like there was two pillows and it was comfy at first, but then it was too high. So I took one of the pills away and then it was too low. So it took me a while to get to sleep. It was also really warm, but I didn't want to open the windows because bugs. I also, for breakfast, I'm going to have some of these hummus crisps because it's either that, toffee popcorn, or some ramen. And hummus crisps seem like the best option. Today is Friday. We still don't really know when we're leaving. I also have no video to upload, so I need to film quite a lot for this one so I can upload this before we leave because I was filming a Glasgow vlog before we left, but I didn't film enough. So that's kind of rubbish. Anyway, I'm gonna let this sit. I'm gonna get back into bed, eat my hummus crisps. Then I'll shower and I'll see what I feel like doing. I just finished getting ready. I honestly don't really like how I look. How many times am I gonna say that in this video? I feel like it's the blush. I just think that I'm like the only person on the planet that blush just does not suit. It just makes me look like I'm like sweaty. Do you know what I mean? Like I've just gone like on a run. I did do two braids in my hair there, which I quite like, but maybe it's adding to the childish look. I'm just watching some YouTube right now. I had my noodles. Oh. I think Danny should be back maybe like an hour it's like half three right now and i am not going to go to the beach by myself because i don't really want to also another reason i realized i can't go outside which is probably just an excuse is that i've got no suntan lotion and look at me do you think that i can go outside with no suntan lotion on and sit at the beach <laughs> Good morning! Today's Saturday and we have kidnapped Cullen for the day. <laughs> hey Cullen! And we are going to NE Nature Reserve. The first, nature uh, reserve. first ever nature reserve in the British Isles, actually. Wow. We also went to a nice coffee shop this morning for breakfast. 
called The Alley. Yeah, right? that was good. Actually. A nice family run coffee shop. It was really nice. Was that? Uh, no. What? It thinks cooling the person. <laughs> so it's telling cooling for this. Cooling for your seatbelt on. Hey, cooling. We've made it. They were supposed to be sent over there. That's what it's called if anyone wants to come visit. We just had lunch at what's this place called? The Torridon. It was nice but very expensive. It was £16 for a steak pie. It didn't even come with chips. We were actually gonna leave because the first waiter that served us just was like so unfriendly and we thought that it was because we didn't realise that the place was kind of fancy and we don't exactly look very fancy right now. We like, felt snobby. Yeah, we were like, oh, it's because like, we look kind of young and we're kind of dressed like not that well. So we were like, right, we'll just have a drink here and leave. But then the second person and then the third person who served us were nice, so it was all right. Danny wants to show you where he walked yesterday. That hill, right? All the way up there. You zoom in. See if I can get well, and that's the smaller peak. A, oh, you can just see the big, the bigger one keeking round to the back. So now we are just going on a walk. Burn off, have tea, lunch. Yeah, I feel really full. We oh. are just leaving Inverness. We thought we'd come to Inverness for the day. We just got caught in a bit of a... a bit of a summer shower. I bought quite a few nice things, but Bits. I'll show you that when we get back and I look a bit better. I wish I'd gone to more shops. Yeah, it's because we've got to go and get some food now from the Tesco, the big Tesco. We just oh. got back from Inverness and like I wanted catching. to give you a haul of what we got. The first place we went was a bookshop, which I showed. Wikis. Do you want to show what you got? Yeah, <laughs> Sharp's Prey. It's if anyone's ever watched um, a TV show called Sharp, played by Sean Bean. They all know because it's a mean minute. Mm. The compilation of Sean Bean going busted. I don't like it. I From watched this. it. I don't like it. It's pretty. It's top tier comedy. And Thanks. I bought this book. You're I... so literary. Yeah, I know. It's on my, it's not even on the reading list. No, it's, it's one of the recommended. It's one of the recommended books for Romantic Lit, which is a course that I'm taking next year, next semester. And what does romantic mean? Not love stories. Not love stories. Not that kind of romantic. The romantic era. Oh, wow. See, this is why she goes to uni. So they told us that this is a recommended book to read. So I thought I would get that. Hopefully it's going to be interesting. I'll save the clothes till last because they're the best part. We got these two vases in the charity shop. They were both £1.25 each. Bargain. Well, it wasn't really... The original price was £2.99. Bargain. So, That's better than half price. Then, going on to clothes, the first thing I got were these trousers. These vintage Laura Ashley trousers. Yeah, they're from Laura Ashley, so they're actually vintage because Laura Ashley's closed down. Right a business. Uh, the clothes are obviously in high demand. <laughs> these were, oh look, they're spotty inside. These were £4.50. And if they fit, I haven't tried them yet. If they fit, they're going to be really good. I just, I'm too scared to try them on right now because I'm really bloated. So I think that they're not going to fit if I try them on right now. did have bolognese and dough balls and cookie the dough for lunch. Yeah, but it was good. Then I bought this top, which I feel like it's hard to see if I don't try it on. But it's like a wrap kind of top. So it's like that and then it ties in the centre. This was three ninety nine. I think this is going to be really nice. Mm -hmm. For summer, you know. Why Could also be a good like swimming costume cover up, like a bikini cover up. For the times you go swimming. Yeah, all the times we get to wear bikinis. I think I've seen you go swimming Scotland. like twice. Well, where, where would I go swimming? <laughs> the last thing I got was this dress, originally from Wallace. <laughs> <laughs> it's this dress. 
It was five pounds. I really hope it fits. It's like a long dress. I reckon this would have been kind of expensive because mm -hmm. I think Wallace is kind of pricey. I'm not sure. It's kind of like a granny. Yeah, mm -hmm. like a mum and granny shop. No offense, we shop for Wallace. Or a mum. If you like your mum or a or granny. granny. <laughs> Hopefully, this is gonna fit. It's a twelve, but it says it's petite, and also I think that that looks pretty small to be honest. That was everything we got. Yeah, good deal. Kind of warm now. That was a lot of effort. And we collected <laughs> and then, Tesco order. Successful day. And to fruit pastels. Now we're having some... You get blood orange gin. Bye. See you later. Hopefully that haul was interesting. I thought it'd spice up the vlog a bit. Because there hasn't been any shopping here. But I think that was quite good. No way is Juliet cooking dinner. <laughs> what did he take? day out today to MVU Gardens. Juliet's only mowed four times so we're doing well today. I'm not moaning. <laughs> We've also taken Cullen for the day again. He's a responsible dog.